Hello everyone. Today we will see how to uh, integrate TypeScript and Cucumber to a Cypress framework. To do that, we need to follow a uh, few steps. Then the step number one is we need to install Node.js and Cypress in our machines. In my case, I have already installed. And in you, in your case, if you want, uh, please watch my previous video how to install Cypress and Node.js so that you can also get installed in your systems. And the step number two is we need to add tsconfig.json file to the uh, to the project to our project in the root directory to get the typescript support we need to add the tsconfig.json file in the project root directory so that we can get the typescript support for the cypress to do that we need to open any of the web browser and navigate to the cypress.io go to click on the docs here here click on the docs Under the docs in the left side panel, we can see there is a tooling option. So we'll click on these toolings. And under the toolings, there is a uh, TypeScript option is available. So click on that. So as of now, copy this code. And as they are recommended, we are doing it. So tsconfig.json, we need to paste this code into that uh, ts dot tsconfig.json file. So to do that, open the project. In my case, I'm using Visual Studio Code. So it's up to you the ID is, uh, whichever you familiar with. And under the root directory, just create one file. Name it as tsconfig.json. And save it and paste the code which we are copied earlier and close it and the step number uh, three is we need to install the TypeScript to do that we need to navigate to the we need to open the project and the, in the terminal we need to type this command npm install TypeScript Once the installation got completed, we can see this found zero vulnerabilities. And uh, step number uh, four is we need to install the Cucumber uh, configuration. We need to install the Cucumber plugin and we need to add the configuration to the project. To, in order to do that, we need to install this plugin. So, in my case, I have already written, so copy this and paste it here npm install at types Cypress Cucumber preprocessor. So it has every each and every type of it so that we can uh, use cucumber in the typescript this is also a one one of the plugin to utilize cucumber in the typescript in cypress so this is also getting installed successfully and the step number five is we need to navigate to the url because we need to add the typescript configuration now so to do that, we need to navigate to this URL, copy, and as of now, I'm closing this window. So paste it. Let me paste the. Edit. So yeah. Once you navigate to that URL, you can get the all the installation steps and all the configuration steps here. Just click on any of the. So like we need to we need to install the. TypeScript right so just go to the installation and add all the code whatever it there in they are suggesting to add Cypress plugins in index.js go to the Cypress plugin in index.js paste the code and in Cypress.json we need to add this you can find the cypress.json in the project root directory just paste it save it and close it so one more thing that we need to do is we need to add this code as well in the package.json that also you can find in project root directory paste and save and close it rtsconfig.json 
I think we missed something. Let me check where exactly we need to create that. The talks where they have mentioned. Yeah, sorry. We need to create this folder under Cypress. So, but I have created in the project root directory. So move this file to Cypress and move. Now, the error is gone. Yep. And the next thing we need to do is uh, we need to change the uh, plugin files extension to TS because we are no more going to work with the JavaScript. So to do that, we need to go to the support and support rename these files. Command at TS to command at JS to TS. This is also index.js to ts and at the same time plugin also. In the plugins also we need to rename it to ts. Now let me check the yeah. Last step we need to install browser file to get the support of uh, uh cyber TypeScript npm install. Ah, okay, come on. I have wrongly typed here, so give me a minute. So, anyway, it got installed. We can check all the dependencies whether they are uh, installed or not uh, under the package.json in the in the dependencies section. So, as of now, close it and we need to navigate to this uh, website again and scroll up and you can find the typescript support just click on it so without of the box we need to pick the we need to choose the without of the without of the box support and we need to copy this code and we need to paste this code in uh, under a plugins index.js there is a plugins folder right in the index.js we can remove this code and we can replace with a new code and save it now let's check whether the typescript got uh, integrated successfully or not so in order to do that we need to create a folder under integrations like common under common we need to create the step definition and do exactly what I'm doing here otherwise you may get errors so under uh, under the integrations create a folder called features and the mod under the features create your own modules whatever the modules uh, you're going to work with uh, depends upon your project so as of now to make it simple uh, I'm using simple Google and I have like that And under the Google, you can create your own uh, step uh, feature files. To do that, create a feature file and name it as open google dot feature. Under feature, you can create a feature. Name it as open google. To make it easier, I am going with simple names. Scenario. And we need to use event. Oh, come on. Search. Okay. Let me copy this. And under the step definitions, we need to create the step definitions. We need to implement the steps for this feature, right? So create under the step definitions, integrations, common, 
under common step definitions under the step definition we need to create the step we need to implement the steps of this feature to do that create the file in the under step definition and name it as google steps.ts so please keep that in mind we should the 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 step definition file prefix should be ma should match with the module name so then only it will work otherwise it won't work you won't you won't be able to execute properly okay so follow the code uh, that i'm going to write here i'm not going to explain how ts uh, typescript will work and all if you are not if you are not familiar with typescript go and find out some online tutorials but as of now follow the code what i am trying to do here and we need to import the packages for the steps from the module of cucumber uh, okay i think uh seems like sorry guys the issue is we need to install the plugin called cypress cucumber preprocessor as well so once you get installed then it will work fine so in my case i have already installed so to do that we just need to enter this command in the command prompt and do click on enter it will get the plugin get a uh, in, install automatically so now seems i think now it will work fine yeah cypress cucumber preprocessor and don't forget to add steps at the end otherwise it won't be able to you won't be able to execute this now next we'll implement steps let me implement steps here since the feature file is related to google let's uh, copy the google url just copy this and paste it under the double quote and save it and that's it now check whether the integrations are working fine or not to do that we need to open the test runner of cypress by using this command npx cypress open the first time it will take some time so please wait yes seems everything is good here uh, let's try to run this whether it will work properly or not yes the integrations are working fine we're able to navigate to the google here yeah that's it for this video guys i hope you guys like it and if from now onwards you can start using cypress cucumber and type typescript together yeah, this is how we need to implement the framework thank you guys thank you guys for watching We'll meet at next video. Bye bye.